TypeScript is a mechanism that allows you to tell the compiler to treat a value as having a specific type, even if the compiler might infer a different type. It's important to use type assertions with caution, as they can potentially bypass type safety checks and lead to runtime errors if used incorrectly. Here's what you need to know about type assertions. Purpose. Overriding the inferred type. Sometimes, the compiler might not be able to accurately infer the type of a value due to complex logic or external factors. Type assertions allow you to explicitly tell the compiler what type you believe the value has. Interacting with JavaScript code. When working with JavaScript libraries or frameworks that don't have proper type definitions, type assertions can be used to bridge the gap and provide type information to TypeScript. Syntax. There are two main ways to perform type assertions. 1. Angle bracket syntax. Less than type greater than. 2. As keyword, value as type. Both methods achieve the same outcome, but the as keyword is generally preferred for readability. Example. Cautions. Not a replacement for proper type safety. Type assertions don't change the actual value or its type at runtime. They only inform the compiler of your assumption about the type. Potential runtime errors. If your type assertion is wrong, the program might still throw an error at runtime, even if the compiler doesn't detect it beforehand. Use sparingly. Overuse of type assertions can make your code less readable and maintainable. Use them only when necessary and be confident about your reasoning. Alternatives. Consider these alternatives before resorting to type assertions. Type casting, similar to type assertions, but also performs runtime checks, can be slower. Type guards, functions that verify the type of a value at runtime, more explicit and safer. Rewriting code, refactoring your code to avoid the need for type assertions could be the best solution in some cases. Remember, type assertions are a powerful tool, but use them judiciously and only when necessary to maintain type safety and clarity in your TypeScript code.